Hi, I'm Sean Gim, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about solving quadratic equations by factoring. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here, 3k squared plus 72 equals 33k, and we need to solve this by factoring. Well, first thing I want to do is get this equation equal to zero. So I'm going to subtract a 33k to both sides. We're left with then a 3k squared minus a 33k plus 72, and that's equal to zero. So one thing I notice is that there is a three in all three parts here. So if I pull out that three, I'm left with a k squared minus 11k plus 24. And now I have, well, three times this whole quadratic. If I divide both sides by 3, what happens? If I divide both sides by 3, this cancel, and we're left with a k squared minus 11k plus 24 equals, well, 0 divided by 3 is 0. Now this problem here is a lot easier to deal with, especially when we're factoring. So look at my uh, c value being 24, and I want to break down the numbers that multiply to be 24. That's 1 and 24, 2 and 12, 3 and 8, and 4 and 6. Okay. Now, since my b value is a negative 11 and my c value is a positive 24, I know both of these numbers must be negative. Because two numbers that, mul that are negative, that multiply by 24, but add to be negative 11. Okay? They both have, will have to be negative. So now I'm trying to find which numbers are they. And that is actually 3, or negative 3, and negative 8. Negative 3 plus negative 8 is a negative 11. So this breaks down to be a k minus a 3 times a k minus an 8 equals 0. And there we have it in factored form. So now since we have this thing factored, we can set both parts individually equal to 0 to solve. So we take the k minus 3 equals 0, and the k minus an 8 equals 0. And now we have to solve each part individually. We add a 3 to both sides, and k equals a positive 3. We add an 8 to both sides, and k equals a positive 8. And so my two solutions for k is k equals 3 and k equals 8. And that is our final answer. I hope you found this video helpful. And if you did, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching. Minute math, minute math, when you need help you use minute math.